Welcome to the new episode, probably nothing, of the IOTA news from the whole month of September. I'm Alexander, was probably too long on vacation and you really have a lot of catching up to do. Here we go. The length of the video is in no way reflects the progress of IOTA and the development of project mentioned here. At the beginning of the month, a great news come out from Aka Germany. This is a subsidiary of the a deco group and partner of a Formula One racing steel, a stock company in Zürich. According to its own information, ACA develops in tokenization, smart contracts, identity and streams of IOTA areas. Also the integration into an existing project is currently carried out. Here the project chains to bike was taken. The aim of the joint project is the use of DLT to ensure documentation and secure ownership of e-bikes or other vehicles, as well as to prevent tampering. Holger Köter is now also on the advisory board of IOTA and he also presents a new startup, Stealth. But also Regine Haschka-Helmer is involved in this new startup. On the 22nd of September, Holger then sent another tweet that was quite interesting. Resourceful detectives immediately started looking for what it has with this message, with this image supervision. And apparently it is Pace 5. Confirmed, but it's not. Moonvolt started a Twitter space earlier this month with Shimmercy, Tanglehub and ICCD as guests. You can listen to the whole conversion now on YouTube. Also Soonlabs has been busy this month, the team has delivered a lot of news. The big announced Sooniverse update was released earlier this month. So if you haven't been on the site for a long time, you will hardly recognize the exterior. If you want to read all the updates on 6 pages, you can read in the document as always linked in the description. Let's continue with NFTs on Sooniverse. Everybody knows that the moment it is more central on the platform. But this will change with Shimmer. You can mint your whole NFT collection on Shimmer from the first day of Shimmer. Adam showed a great video as an example. Also, trading Shimmer IOTA will be possible from the first day of Shimmer. For those of you who want to create your own token, you still need to read and follow the KYC instructions. On Friday, Adam shared a video on Twitter showing the speed and simplicity of making your NFT collection that centralized with the release of Shimmer. But what's next for Sooniverse? That's what the team revealed in a blog post on 26th of September. First comes another update, the 014, which corrects bugs and brings small improvements. With the release of Shimmer, Sooniverse will be offline for one or two hours. After that, the following features will follow. Token airdrop, token launchpad, experience points will be native tokens with all the same benefits and features like blackout periods. Trading soon and other tokens will also be possible. The last feature listed is to become soon staking. For details feel free to read the full article, more information on staking will be added over time. You like probably nothing? You agree that IOTA is barely developing and you're just upset because it's the biggest scam? Then how about supporting this channel and my work? You have too much IOTA? Then donate and support my work. Wipe out your mobile Firefly or TanglePay app and try the send feature. I'll wait too. You so excited about the latest Sooniverse news and want to buy an NFT? How about the Super Silum? There are only 19 left. Or how do the IOTA nerds sound to you? All this doesn't make you happy and you need to sacrifice your Onyomnia further? Then join the Patreon and or YouTube member club and officially show that you celebrate IOTA and the whole development. IOTA B tweeted that you can finally do the first token swap and I tried it. If you haven't seen the video yet, feel free to do so. From the 19th of September everyone can now swap tokens and use IOTA B. With the release of Shimmer, many DeFi platforms will launch and the IOTA Foundation is therefore giving the community a chance to educate themselves on this topic. For this, they have invited Bankless Consulting to work through different topics in several videos. The first course is about wallets and how to interact with DeFi. The second course is about token swaps, DEX and SEX. The first episode is about DeFi, lending and borrowing. Let's move on to TanglePay. The team has been very busy as well. On IOTA B you can link your wallet and trade IOTA. You can also see this in my video about IOTA B. Also the security audit at TanglePay was performed by 30k. You really can't say now that you shouldn't use TanglePay. Also soon you can claim your shimmers in the app. 
Also, you can update the app to version 1 for free. Let's stay with wallets and go to Firefly. There has been incredible progress here as well. So earlier this month, the team wrote about what are we feasible with the Firefly wallet with the Shimmer launch. With the update, it will be possible to claim Shimmer tokens, manage other native tokens, complete microtransactions, add expiration times to transactions, and there will be Ledger Nano support. A few days later, they officially released the Firefly mobile app on Android and iOS. Then they also released a Firefly update on September on GitHub. Here they described the next steps preparing for Shimmer and aligning with the desktop version. A nice feature in the future will be to be able to seamlessly buy IOTO tokens from Firefly. With that in mind, the new Firefly website was launched to better showcase the mobile application. You can now admire it at firefly.iota.org. To loosen up, we leave IOTA and Shimmer and turn our attention to assembly. Little info on staking. The event is still running as of today, the 27th of September, just under 579 million assembly has been distributed. Also, the assembly article landed with the DeFi project in the top 5 most read article on CoinMarketCap. Back to the projects. Silicon Droid Inc., the company that makes smartwatches with IOTA integration, have new devices for sale soon. For those interested, the watches cost 92 euro and will be available soon. BeastGen published an article on how they integrate IOTA in their Falcor platform. The Falcor platform is used to exchange sensitive data. Currently, the API on the Tangle can write, read, and overwrite. That's all we know yet. If you don't want to just talk, but also program and enrich the ecosystem, feel free to watch Kumar's tutorials. In many small videos, he explains how you can easily integrate Shimmer, for example, create an account or update the balance. Do you remember Omoku? That's where you used to be able to buy IOTA. The team is coming back under a new name, Viviswap. Then you can buy crypto and including IOTA again from your bank account. Also, there will be KYC free transactions. How that should go with the new EU rules, I'm curious. The first NFT projects are running over to IOTA. Vainbrains is one of them. The news that it was a medical software company is wrong. They are NFT. Yet it's nice to see these projects move over. What do 1970 documents, 2778 comments, 107572 additions and 82151 deletions have on common? That's right. A new blog post from Shimmer and their release of Smart Contracts version 0.3.0. With the new version, the framework is compatible with the Shimmer network. Once the IOTA mainnet is upgraded to Stardust, it will also be compatible with IOTA. With new features like full spectrum Stardust ledger support, enhanced EVM support, improved reliability, recoverability, improved tooling, gas support, and many other improvements, smart contracts are taking off. Remember Loyal? The IOTA project with the stamp cards? Well, the app has been around for quite some time and now the team is getting into the NFT business. They want to bring more use cases here than just images. A very big development come to the public on the 13th of September and concerns the IOTA Foundation as a foundation itself. Already a long time ago, Dom announced to register IOTA also in Switzerland as a foundation, because in Switzerland foundations have more possibilities, for example, to deal with advertising. This has now finally happened on the 8th of September, under the name Verein Tangle Ecosystem. Again, this is a non-profit organization with a focus to strengthen and support the IOTA ecosystem, technologies as well as applications. Congrats to Dom and the whole team. Let's relax a bit again with some top ranking in cyberspace, in crypto space. There we have first place with the highest click pay, seventh place with the most engagement and a week later tenth place with the most engagement and fifth place with the most bullish trends on doyourownresearch.net on the FTX platform. With the registration in Switzerland, you can now also do marketing and Dom asked on Twitter what you can do now. There came many submissions, good, bad, interesting, but only one that I myself find truly good and this is to engage more developers. You can read the suggestions on the official site govern.iota.org or the many tweets. CoinGecko has listed Shimmer on his website, currently as preview only. You are welcome to sign up there and give it a star. 
which only about 400 stars, it's not a big success we are facing. The ICCD also celebrates a great success. They are now official and non-profit cooperation in the Marshall Islands. This was a proposal that was accepted by the community a few months ago. In the middle of the month, the IOTA Foundation updated its roadmap, which can be founded at roadmap.iota.org. A new project welcomes the Touchpoint program on Shimmer, and that is a jungle race. This is about a Mario Kart-like game that also lets you earn cryptocurrency. But it's not just a game, it's also a platform for future developers to get an arsenal of tools. I'm looking forward to trying the game. Gold Standard published an article where they plan to release a creation of digital tokens for CO2 allowances. Gold Standard is working closely with Climate Check and IOTA. Now it's a matter of waiting for the proposal to be accepted or rejected. Audit One, a testing company for smart contracts, NFT and other web free products is now also partnering with the Shimmer Network. For example, Shimmercy, Bifrost and Stealth Project are audited by Audit One. Matt speaks up on Discord above Alvarium and the Austin, Texas transportation project. For both, he affirms that the project are live and very active, even if it's not communicated and updated as often by other partners. The last sentence of the Alvario message really makes you want to know more. One of the biggest conglomerates has taken a look at it and reacted positively. Cobalt on Twitter has found something new from Alfred the Transport Project here in Germany. So on the 29th of September, the first test should run. I guess the program is ready and you can sign up now. It will publish a smart city control center, show a use case in goods and delivery traffic and present at intelligent delineators. You can even see the letter as an image now. On the 16th of the September, Shimmer will publish a blog article with the testnet launch for the smart contract, which means everyone who wants to try smart contracts on Shimmer can do so now. That IOTA has no progress is also shown by the following case. On the 11th of September, Toshiba Limited in Bristol published a paper, IOTA Tangle 2.0 toward a scalable, decentralized, smart and autonomous IoT ecosystem. The paper read like butter when you read the abstract. These developments continue to position IOTA Tangle as a highly attractive DLT for the IoT industry. Navin tweeted the following in response. That is scary how quickly the protocol has evolved and that many components are out of date, are already improved. There you see it again. No development, only regression forward. Türkiye ye merhaba. Erkin Sahinus explains probably in over 20 minutes IOTA. I can not say much about the content, but hope that the Turkish viewers come here on their information. Timson Labs has started another big project. He, IOTA Read and Infioda want to find all the exchanges that want to list Shimmer or already have. So if you have seen Shimmer in the wild, contact the free and support the community. Pipe, the project on Tanglehub now has a website. Pipe provides decentralized data storage and transmission. Roadmap, light paper or information about the Pipe token will follow. Yesterday, Pipe published another article, which is linked in the description. Coming to Shimasi, they were audited by HashX, a company known for collateral in blockchain in DeFi sectors. Unfortunately, I didn't find out what exactly comes out, but it won't stop at one audit, because this week Shimasi announced that they will start another audit and even a bug bounty program. This time the audit will be done by Audit1. The DeFi sector is exploding. With the launch of Shimmer we will have so much choice that is scary. And since we can get enough here, we welcome Deeper, another DeFi project on Shimmer. The whole thing was developed by Nakama Labs. Beefrest has added documentation, the white paper and the user paper on the website. Now you can better understand the project, that was one of the things in the community that was added. Let's move on to bad news. Yes, there's that with IOTA too. Kami Labs is closing the doors. As a reason, a variety of different factors are listed. War, Ripple Luna, Seal Celsius. The cry of the community is of course big, because here money projects just fall away. But according to statements, Inspired will probably rush out some information in the next few months and maybe save one or the other project. Dom has officially published a TA prophecy on Twitter. According to it, Shimmer will rise $1.33. Resonate Finance pledged support for IOTA and Shimmer, also tweets Dominic on the 25th of September. 
Revest wants to offer the IOTA protocol to new projects as they are very enthusiastic about it. More announcements will follow later. The Revest protocol offers a new use of NFT as a financial instrument with the financial non-fungible token, short FNFT. The good Mondelo has discovered a new patent. The whole thing was filled by Hitachi Transport System and is indeed to provide transparent distribution where the location of a token is shared between token owners and distributors, which you can see quite clearly in the image. That IOTA is getting so much popularity in and free publicity the last few days is not an isolated incident. Crypto chefs tell in their new video about IOTA and show their community what IOTA can do. Same with MSN.com. This published an article titled Mooners and Shakers, US dollar depressed markets, but cryptocurrency sold out. IOTA rises on new token use. That pushes us forward. Tangle Labs has released Identify Manager. You can now find the whole thing on GitHub. But beware, according to the disclaimer, this is only an alpha release and has not been controlled. As penultimate news, Bitforex has written a cryptic tweet. What can it mean? And as last news, who would have thought it, the obligatory updates on the Discord follow to protocols, etc. Firefly Stardust Beta comes out in version 6, 7 and 8. That will be the latest beta now. Hornet has reached version 2.0, beta 8 and 9. Thanks for watching. I don't think I'll never take another vacation knowing there's so much coming way and until the next episode. Uh, you guys are still there. Something happened? I don't think so. True. Dom still tweets at the last minute that fool.com and you dot today writes about IOTA. Really a lot of attention, but why? I just can't figure out why IOTA is trading like this now.